What's good guys, Fernando here, back with another video. Got a really, really quick for sale video for you guys. Well, hopefully it's quick. We'll see how that goes. Um, just trying to get rid of some stuff that I'm not really wearing that much and just trying to replace it with some new stuff to bring to you guys. So yeah, let's get straight into it. All right guys, first off we got this wings and horns hoodie in a size medium. It's made out of a cotton slub. Pretty, pretty slimming in my opinion, if it's really, really nice. We got dual re-re zippers, as you guys can see. These are a bit different than the ones John uses, just a different model. Um, let's you guys let, let you guys look at the tags. So there you guys can see the tags, wings and horns. This is a size medium, it's made in Canada. It retailed for, I don't remember, but I believe it was around 190-ish. I wanna say, I'll link the video right here on screen so you guys can check that out, see how it fits and stuff like that. Um, I'm gonna start at a price of 140 shipped. Actually, 145 shipped. Yeah, 145 shipped. But I am willing to work with you guys on a price if you guys are trying to actually buy this. So definitely hit me up. As far as how to pay, my PayPal will be, actually no, scratch that. DM me on Twitter with your PayPal the item you want, and then I will send you an invoice, and then you guys can pay that way. If not, just DM me on Twitter and we'll work something out. All right guys, next up we got another hoodie and another size medium. This is made out of like a lightweight French terry. Actually, I don't even know if I would call it a terry. It's just really, really different. Um, let's see if, if I can zoom in on this so you guys can see. So that's the material. Um, it's almost a terry, maybe I don't even know, but you guys can see it. Um, this is by the brand Rodarte, as you guys can see. It retails for about $195 to either $205 after tax. I forget what it was. Something around that. Um, but basically, I'm trying to sell this for $155 shipped. I am also willing to work with you guys on a price, if you guys are actually interested. Um, Off-white drawstrings, black Rodarte. If you guys are interested in this, Kanye did wear it. And yeah, the overall fit is pretty pretty true to size, pretty boxy, standard length, and extended arms that are pretty slim, so you do get that stack action if you guys are into that. And yeah, definitely hit me up on Twitter if you guys are interested. DMs are always open. Alright guys, next up we got an Alexander Wang tee. This is a long sleeve and I believe a size medium or small. Actually, it might be a small. Let me check. Alright, so yeah, this is in fact a size small. Fits very, very, very true to size. Pretty slim in the arm. And overall fits awesome in my opinion. This is a perfect fitting long sleeve. I just did not get as much wear out of it as I thought I would. So um, I am letting this go for 70 shipped. I believe retail prices on these are like 90-ish. So I'm definitely willing to work with you guys. I would say, actually scratch that. Let's do... 65 shipped and yeah definitely hit me up on twitter if you're trying to actually buy this definitely an awesome essential piece that you can wear whenever and also looks great rolled up so if you guys are trying to wear this in the spring too also perfect as a standalone as well all right next up we have the same t-shirt but in a beige color this one is actually a bit more i would say hard to find or at least hard to come across and this is in a size medium, let me make sure. Okay, so I was completely wrong. This is actually a size small, which I did not know. Um, there you guys can get a look at the tag. Really awesome color. I really, really like this color. It's my only like not basic color tee besides a navy. But um, once again, I did not get as much wear out of it as I thought. Um, I would say this fits very true to size. So if you're a small medium, I'm an XL and John Elliott if that helps you guys. I know it's super weird, but it's, it's a whole nother story on my shoulders or whatever. But yeah, awesome piece. I am letting this one go for, we said 65 on that one. This one's harder to come across. We'll do 72 shipped. So yeah, hit me up on Twitter on the DMs and yeah, we'll get a price to you guys. Um, a little bit less flexible on this one compared to that one because this one I just really really like and I would not mind keeping All right guys next up. We got a surface to air tee that I did pick up at RSVP gallery a bit over a year ago now Probably my favorite fitting boxy tee size large this fits um, I would say 
true as far as this goes, this area, but a little bit right more. It hits me mid zipper on my pants, I would say. So a little bit shorter than usual, but as far as what's trending right now, shorter tees and boxy fits are definitely coming back. So perfect tee for this spring. Has an awesome wash. You guys can see that, like it's all around the seams. Definitely a really, really well detailed piece. On the back, you do have the surface to air screen printed. And yeah, overall, actually on the bottom, there's also another touch. It is a surface to air little button there. This did retail for a steep 110. I'm willing to let this go for We'll start at 80 ship, but I'm pretty flexible on this one. So definitely hit me up on Twitter and we'll get a price to you guys. All right, uh, I don't know if any of you guys are gonna wanna buy these, but I don't even know if they're in stock anymore. So for those that did miss out, these are the H&M Velour sweatpants in a maroon slash burgundy. I wore these quite a few times, not gonna lie, but as of right now, I just got my wares out of them. And honestly, like for the price, I don't even remember. I think it was 20, 30, something like that but um i barely wore them so i'm gonna just stick to 20 because i wouldn't mind keeping these but if you guys did miss out i'll just ship them for retail retail plus shipping so i would say after tax it was like 22 shipping another five dollars so we'll do we'll just settle at 25 shipped and for those who want them you guys can have them and yeah and if these are still in stock, just correct me in the comments and just tell me to fuck off. All right, next up, we're moving into the shoes. Um, these are the Van Skate Highs, as you guys can see. As you guys can see my mess back there. I mean, classic shoe. I mean, you can't, you can't really say much about it. These retail for 65. These are a, a size nine and a half. Actually, I forgot to say sizing on these. These are small, so you guys can also see a video on those. I think I have a video on them. I actually may not, but I do have a lookbook video on them, so definitely check that out if you guys didn't see that, which you should have. But yeah, Vansky High, if you clean them up, if you guys watch Avery's channel, um, he made a video on his Vans Take Lollapalooza, and he made those shits look brand new, so just follow what he did, and you'll probably have a damn near close to brand new pair of Skate Highs in your closet. These retail 65. My shoebox is at home, so we'll knock down another 10 and call it 55 retail. Um, they're worn, so let's knock off another 15 and we'll just ship them like that. So we'll do 35 shipped on the vans. No box. So, but nine and a half, you clean them up, you save 30 bucks, and that's almost 50% savings. So, there you guys go. Another shoe I don't have the box with me in college is the Flyknit Lunar 1 in gray. This is the Wolf Gray, I believe. I do have a video on these as well, back when my channel was ass. But, um, yeah, if you guys did watch that review, you're OG as fuck. But these are the Flyknit Lunar 1s in a size, let's see. These are actually 10 and a halves. Maybe a half size small? Yeah, I would say a half size small. But yeah, um, if you're 10, 10 and a half, they'll fit you. Um, what was, I don't even remember retailing those, but let's just do 90 shipped. If you guys think that price is too high, just let me know on Twitter and we'll work something out. Another shoe that you can probably still get dirty for retail is, I think you can get them for like 50 at Foot Lockers and shit. These are pretty well worn. If you clean them up once again, you wash the laces. Hit it, hit it with some Jason Mark. You'll have a pretty damn near close Stan Smith's. Classic shoe. You can't really go wrong with them. We will do 30 shipped on those. And finally, a shoe I've been wearing quite often. The Black Pure Boost. This is really what started the whole boost type. And um, awesome shoe, to be honest. Um, obviously, you got some dirty heel drag. I've tried to clean that. I think there's just no possible way to. Retail was what 120 I believe and With that heel drag will knock into like what 30 30 bucks off and overall general wear another like 15 bucks off so 45 what is that oh, fuck? I don't feel doing math like 85 is 85 shipped straight actually no these are worth more than these so we'll do 85 shipped on these and 90 shipped on these Yeah, gang I think that's it 
overall that's about it from me guys um more stuff will be for sale as this stuff moves out of here so definitely stay tuned my grailed will be in the description below if you guys are willing to just buy it through grailed and just ignore the whole strictly paypal to me cash thing whatever um most of this stuff is on grail besides the shoes and a few of the pieces but um i will get those up as soon as possible probably before this video i hope if i'm not too lazy but if not once again my twitter down in the description i'll just leave my handle right here for you guys so you guys can definitely hit those and hit me in the dms and besides that all social media down in the description below i'll see you guys in the next video peace